Hey kitty, are you hungry for lunch? Yeah, sure. I was thinking we should go to Burger King. No, but wait. I heard McDonald's is having Lila's pet shop prizes in their Happy Meals. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go! Yay, we're finally here! I'm so glad we came because I am hungry. Hello, welcome to McDonald's. Can I take your order? Well, yes, I will have one cheeseburger Happy Meal and one chicken McNugget Happy Meal. Okay, that would be 703. Please walk up to the next window. Gee, kitty, I wonder what kind of Littlest Pet Shop Kids Meal toy it will be. Gee, I'm not sure, but I'm sure it's going to be awesome because all Littlest Pet Shop toys are fun. Okay, your order is complete. Here is your cheeseburger Happy Meal. And we have one Chicken McNugget Happy Meal right here. Hurry, let's take our food downstairs so that we can eat. Boy, these Play-Doh Happy Meal boxes are adorable. You know, honestly, I didn't come here for the food. I came here for the price. So let's open up our Happy Meal toys. I totally agree. Yay! Okay, let's see what we got. <gasps> I got a bunny and you got a puppy. Holy cow, how did these things fit in our Happy Meal box? These things are huge. Must be magic. Do you believe in magic? Well, enough with that. Let's get them out of their little containers. Here's my bunny. It's pink and beautiful. And here's your puppy. Oh, he looks kind of sad. Don't be sad, puppy. You came from a Happy Meal. Well, time to go home now. Click here to see Micro Drifters, Lightning McQueen, and Sally get attacked by hex bugs. Thanks for watching and have a great day.
Disney Card Toys here and today I'm showing you the Play-Doh Breakfast Time Set. I have Tigger and Lightning McQueen here to help me today and they also want to eat everything when I'm finished. Whoa, 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 Tigger, not yet. That's the box. That's just a picture. That's not even the Play-Doh. I'm going to start by making a waffle first. So just grab a chunk of your brown Play-Doh for the waffle and stick it in your Play-Doh waffle iron. I'm going to pre-smush it a little bit. Just make sure I have enough Play-Doh in here. Okay, looking good. And we'll just press it down hard. Really hard just to make sure. And, oh, there's our waffle. Looking pretty good. Just rip off the extra little scraps here on the end. Here, Tigger, I'll let you smell it a little bit. It smells good, right? Gonna make sure that Tigger and Lightning McQueen have their fruits and veggies for the day, so I'll make a couple berries to put on the waffle. Right now I'm making a strawberry. Um, there we go, it's stuck in there. Just peel it out. That looks pretty good. It's a little bright, but probably tastes pretty good to a stuffed animal. Let's make another strawberry just to make this meal extra healthy. Here we go. Just peel off the excess Play-Doh. And there's our strawberry. We can also make blueberries, and the set came with blue Play-Doh, which is perfect. Okay, oh, there's one. There we go. Oh, it won't stay. There we go. Let's make another one. Hopefully this one doesn't roll all over the place. Here we go, perfect, beautiful. This waffle iron press has a little cutout to add some butter to. So we'll press out some butter and we'll add it to Tigger and Lightning McQueen's waffle. How many of you guys eat butter with your waffles? I normally don't, but um, when I go to a restaurant, they usually always give it to me with my waffle. Just curious. Whoa, Tigger, come on. We're not ready yet. No, 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 no. And you're eating the waffle press anyway. You're not even eating the waffle. Okay, now for all you meat lovers out there, we're going to make some bacon. Yay! So for the bacon, I'm using some of this bright pink red Play-Doh. And then also I'm going to take a chunk of the white Play-Doh to add the fat to the bacon. Just going to roll it out with my hand a little bit. There we go. There's a little piece of fat there. Ripped it into two, and now we'll press it into this blue press. Press it pretty hard. See how this turned out. Just rip off the edges again like you did with the waffle. Looks pretty fatty on that side, but lean on the other. For those of you on a diet, I figured we can make some turkey bacon. Has about half the fat, so here's just a little piece of fat that we'll press into this turkey bacon. Here we go, press hard again. How many of you guys like turkey bacon over regular bacon? I kind of like it more, sometimes it's crispier. Okay, rip off the edges. Okay, let's compare the two pieces of bacon. See, half the fat. Now moving on to some sunny side eggs. Mmm. For this we'll need the white Play-Doh and then also the yellow Play-Doh for the yolk. So just grab a ball, we'll press it in to one side and then we'll add just a small circle of yellow Play-Doh for the yolk. I'm just going to roll it into a little ball and I'll let the press flatten it out. Here we go. Kind of complicated. Oh, that looks pretty good. That almost looks real. Let's press it again just to make sure. Okay, that looks pretty good. I'll have Lightning McQueen eat that. Let's quickly make some omelet toppings. We've got a mushroom here. We'll put it on the plate. And then we can make a piece of cheese for your omelet. I use the yellow Play-Doh for that. Okay, that's a lot of Play-Doh. It still turns out though, even if you use a lot. A 
looking good. And here's the onion. Um, I could use white, but I'll switch things up a little bit. Do a blue onion just to be a little crazy. Here we go. Now it's time to try out our third press, which is a piece of toast press. I'm going to live on the edge here and try to make a brown crust around my toast. So I grabbed a piece of white Play-Doh and I'm wrapping it around some brown Play-Doh. We'll see if this turns out. I've never tried this before. Okay. Let's try it out. We'll just press it in to the toast press. Squeeze really hard. I did a lot of Play-Doh on that one. And look, a little dial to turn it. That's kind of cool. Looks like a toaster. Let's see if this turned out. Well, uh, it looks okay. It's kind of, kind of looks more like dirty toast, like dipped in coffee or something. But I'm sure the stuffed animals will still eat it. Hmm. Yeah, it's a little interesting looking. Tigger, do you want to taste a little bite? Does it taste okay still? I guess so. Here, I'll add some butter to that toast. Now it looks a little better with butter on it, right? Butter makes everything better. This set also came with a Play-Doh press. It looks a lot like a garlic press. And there's different settings of shapes that you can choose. I chose, this is kind of the star looking shape. So I guess we'll make a noodle or piece of hair or something. We'll try another shape here. Here's a little swirl. I'll do blue. Looks kind of cool, I guess. And they can try eating this too. It's the moment we've all been waiting for. Time to eat, Lightning McQueen and Tigger. I remember, yum, 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 yum. I'm yum, 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 yum. How do you guys like it? Is it good? Here, try one of these mystery noodles. And some of that weird looking toast. And the egg. Is that okay? Uh oh, Tigger, are you okay? Oh no, I think I poisoned him. Let's see how Lightning McQueen fares on his food. His food's a little less weird. So we got bacon, that's pretty normal. Here, try the mystery Play Doh. Oh, oh boy. I poisoned Lightning McQueen too. Man, this just confirms I am not a good cook. Let's see what the box says. Fun to play with, but not to eat. Oops! I should have read the box before feeding it to these stuffed animals. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Hello, Disney Car Toys here, and today you're going to see the mother of all Color Changer Cars videos.
Thanks for watching and have a great day. Here's the leaf plot. And we've got some like this. And there's a lot more of animals. It's very hard to do. You need to look at the instruction. Yes, first you need to put that in there. Um, okay, yeah, yeah. We have. Mm. I think we have sort of like. That okay, one. and here's the animal. It's a dog. Cream dog. Okay. Whoop, whoop. You can do like spins it. Head. Okay, the second egg now. I help you. I know. <laughs> Can I help you? Instruction. Oh, uh, what is it? Here's the instruction. And we have the red one. Which boy? 
Okay. Can I help you? I can you have the stickers? Do you have the stickers? We have a man, two men, and two girls. Those are the two men, and those are the two girls. Why well, are you going to put a man or a girl? Get mad. An egg. You have broken teeth. No. Yes. No. And here's the. Oh, what sticker do you want? Which man? With glasses on. Here's the sticker. See, it opens mouth. I don't know why you can put something in here. Okay, let's That's open the. Oh, let's open the third toy. A brush well for painting. We have got a brush and two colours. We need to put them this together. Is the fly. And that's the pack. Okay. I have it. Ooh. Okay, so we have this three toys all this together. Is the so let's let's show the toys. What can you egg? And I found something like this for the brush. Can we have to paint this? Um, I have another picture. That's just a figure. And oopsie. And that is the painting. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye.